Hi everyone, me again. <laughs> right, I just wanted to show you a few things that I've um, got for baby again. Um, I'm going to start off with the show that I had made for him um, by my friend Gemma. She's actually got a Facebook page called Gems Hair Slides. I'll put the link down in the description box if you want to take a look. She does like girly things and excuse me, I'm a bit out of breath. She does mainly like hair slides and hair accessories and stuff for kids and probably adults if you requested something um, but I also I said to her a few weeks a few weeks ago a couple of weeks ago is there anything you could make for a baby boy so she's got a shawl and she's customized it all a gorgeous ribbon and I love it it's it's going to be a special blanket um, so yeah if you've got any requests and if she can do it then it's worth putting it forward to her so let me show you here it is um, it's lovely. She's stitched little teddies, little gingham teddies on. Um, we've got a little, we've got gingham ribbon, and we've got another lovely like line of blue ribbon there, saying it's a boy on it. And it's got gorgeous little bows that she's done and stitched into place. So I just wanted to show you it because I really like it and I think it's gorgeous. She makes them for girls as well. So yeah, if you want to check out her page, then um, check out the description box, and you'll probably and I'll post the link to it there. Okay. Um, another thing that I've bought is we're quite reluctant to spend a fortune on things like this, changing mats and bouncy chair, something that's not going to be like used for very long. I've learnt my lesson in the past, having um, my four. So I'm quite, like I've said, I'm, I'm reluctant to spend a fortune um, for something that's probably going to get ruined when you start weaning and it ends up with pureed carrot all over it <laughs> that won't come off. But I love the design of these. I thought the, the, the little pictures on them are so cute. To be honest, I'm a little bit disappointed with the chair. Um, as you can see, it's quite high up for a newborn, which is states that it's, that's what it's for. It's from Asda. Um, it was £22, so it's not bad value for money, but, as I've said, unless baby's got a bit of weight behind him, or her, it's not going to go flat all that much, and there's no recline on it, so I don't think I'm going to be using it, probably, till it's a little bit bigger, um, because I've got visions as well of Bobby pinging him across the room in it, <laughs> so uh, it's going to probably be one of these things that's used on, um, you know, when when I'm probably on my own with him and there's no Bobby running around the place but yeah there's no head support either so I think we'll just have to see when the time's right when we're going to put him in it because I definitely would not put a newborn in it um, so yeah but it's got these cute little wee and it plays music and vibrates I don't recognise the song <laughs> But um, it does the job, and it's it's just the same. It does the same things as the last one that I had. It's nothing fancy, and I don't think you really need anything fancy. Um, the changing mat, like I said, I think this was five pounds, and it's just going to get poo and stuff all over it. So you know, I'm not going to spend any more than five pounds. And I like the butterflies and ladybirds on that as well. So I just thought I'd show you those things. I'm going to get going because Lee's hovering around the door trying to get my attention like a child um, and I will see you soon. Okay, bye.